Welcome back everyone to a new Shrine Guide video here on the Proximus Gaming YouTube channel. My name is Michael and in this video the Muo Jim Shrine. Also known as a modest test of strength. The Muo Jim Shrine is located on the far eastern side of Hyrule map, west of Nekluda Sea and Eventent Island. It is easiest to start at the Jarin Shrine, just outside of Lurlin village. We visited this shrine in one of the earlier Shrine Guide videos. If you have not found this shrine yet, or if you don't know where Lurlin village is located, click in the right upper corner now for a link to that Shrine Guide video. In order to find this shrine, the Muojim Shrine, open your map and go to this right spot here. Place a pin and close your map. And now it's pretty easy, just walk towards the pinpoint you just placed. Make sure you're going up here, because to reach the shrine we need to go up. Just walk up here. By the way, make sure it's not raining, because if it's raining, that makes climbing almost impossible. And we don't want that, since we need to climb in order to get to the shrine. If it's raining, we better warp away and warp back. Or sit by a campfire until it's a different time when it's not raining. Just follow the same as I do in this video, then everything should be okay. Just keep on walking. Be careful because there you can see some enemies on horses, some moblins on horses. And as you might know already, I'm a lover, not a fighter, so if I can avoid any type of fight, I will. That's why I prefer to go around them. No, there are two keys coming. Well, I have to kill those. And now just walk towards the shrine because you can see the shrine at the end of the edge there. By the way, if you like this video, then please give this video a thumbs up. And when you're there, hit the subscribe button if you have not done that yet. That way you will not miss my future content and other upcoming shrine guides of The Legend of Zelda. And of course, all the other videos. Keep to the right here. There's an enemy camp at the left there. And the way I do it, they cannot spot me. So you should be safe if you just do exactly the same as I do. I also stream games such as Zelda live on Twitch. Link to my Twitch channel is in the description down below, so feel free to check it out sometime and talk about Zelda. For example, the new Tears of the Kingdom game that will be released in less than a month. Are you excited for that game? I certainly am. Now just keep walking towards the shrine. Oh, some more skull enemies approaching. I think we can avoid them. Just let's go. And there's the Muo Jin Shrine. You made it! Let's get in.
To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Muro Jim. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I offer this combat trial. A modest test of strength, Muro Jim Shrine. And there's a guardian, a small guardian we need to kill. This guardian has a shield and a big sword. Be careful, because this one is kind of strong. Stronger than the ones of the minor test of strength. The best thing to do is just to try and hit him as much as possible. But be careful that you don't get hit yourself. Just like me. Keep hitting him. When he charges, just make sure you're there to hit him when you can. Avoid his attacks and attack him. When he charges again, go stand behind a pillar and attack him once again. Then, the second level, jump up and use your paraglider. Then use your sword to do a jump attack from the sky up on him. Now, stage three. He's acting as a real guardian now. Just keep hitting him. And if everything goes right, you kill him. Congratulations. And if not, try to avoid his attacks and try again to hit him as much as possible. Pick up the loot he dropped. Now go towards the gate that opened. There's a treasure chest there. Open it. And a knight's bow with a strength of 26 is inside. Take it or leave it. It's up to you. Go stand before the monk. And press A. Your triumph over the test of strength. Suburbs, a prophecy of ruin. From the ashes of Hyrule, a hero rises. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Spirit Orb, a symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. May the goddess smile upon you. Perfect, nicely done. Dish shrine completed. Did you think it was difficult? Let me know in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. See ya.